Press. This is Eric Sanders from the Sanders Department of PC. And today I want to talk a little bit about the preparation of foods and negligence claims. Uh, you got to remember, when you go into a commercial business or a place of establishment that sell you food, you have to be cognizant of that sometimes you go into places, but overall majority of times you can eat the food and you have no problems. And you know, you enjoy, you pay, you pay for service, you get a service, and you have no problem. And then on the off a chance that you might go, the off chance you go, and you have sometimes where you have employees that are not responsibly washing their hands and cause foodborne uh, germs to make you sick, or you have foreign objects such as flies and things like that that may be in your food, you may have a cause of accident and negligence. Just remember that food poisoning could make you sick, and not only make you sick in some circumstances, you can actually die from it. So if you ever go into an establishment and you feel like uh, you were sickened by the way they prepared the food or the way they handled the food, you need to think about going and speak to an attorney because you may be awarded damages. In particular, you have to remember that negligence claims are still, for the most part, on the common law. You may have some statutes, it depends on what it is, but for the most part, it's common law. And in New York, you have a three-year statute of limitations, so make sure that you do it within three years. And the three years counts from the time of the injury or upon discovery. But for the most part, it's going to be upon your the date that you ingested or consumed the food. So just remember, if you have a negligent claim, make sure and seek the advice of an attorney because you may be entitled to money damages.